you here, you at home, and especially in our center square, Ted Danson this week. Thank Give you. it up for Becker. <laughs> Our returning champion won our secret square stash with a spa vacation to Hawaii, uh, a trip to Australia, and lots more. $23,915 belongs to Janine Bundy. Welcome back, Janine. And you are challenged in the exposition by Dan Katowski. Good to have you here, Dan. Thank you. Okay, uh, tic-tac-toe game. You decide if the answers you're getting are correct or the stars are making them up. That's how you get the squares. First game is a $1,000 game, and our challenger, Dan, always begins. I'd like to start with uh, Martin Mall. Martin Mall. All right, Martin. Here we go. <laughs> Martin, whose who's Best Of album consists of 38 minutes of silence followed by two minutes of applause? <laughs> oh, that's... Um... Marley Matlin sings Sondheim. <laughs> it's uh, actually Marcel Marceau, oddly enough, uh, got a record deal. I agree. It is Marcel Marceau. Oh yes, it is. X gets the square. Janine. Trace Adkins, please. All right, Trace Adkins is seeing is in stores now. He's coming on tour to a city near you this year. Trace Cowboys in the Old West loved Chuck. What was Chuck? Well, Chuck was the really happy cowboy that always <laughs> forgot to put his Wrangler jeans on under his chest. You know, <laughs> Chuck was just a free spirit, you know, and a uh, free lot of stuff. But, uh... Everybody knows that, that Chuck was grub. Grub. Food. I agree. Food, yeah, grub. You got it. Yes, circle. Yes, that one. Dan? I'm going to go with David Branner. David Branner, appearing at the Orleans in Las Vegas, May 29th through June 1st. All right, David, Bill Clinton stepped off a plane in Japan recently and was stunned to find hundreds of screaming teenagers. Why were they there? They were the finalists in the Monica Lewinsky uh, look-alike contest. <laughs> ooh, ooh. What are you booing me? I didn't do it. <laughs> Thank God. Uh, the reason they, because he had uh, given them a lot of, he gave a lot of money to the organization they belonged to. I agree. No, they were waiting for Leonardo DiCaprio <laughs> uh, on another plane. So, uh, Circle gets that one. Janine? Baba Booey, please. Baba Booey, Gary Delabate. We'll be at Valley Total Fitness in Saddlebrook, New Jersey, May 29th, on the elliptical trainer. Uh, Gary, what celebrity wrote a book called, Does Anybody Have a Problem With That? Uh, I read like two books a month because I produce and I have to know what's going on. It's uh, James Gandolfini, Tony Soprano. I agree. But he doesn't read well. It's Bill Maher. <laughs> <laughs> Bill Maher. X gets that one, Dan. Ted Danson for the win. Ted Danson for the diagonal win. Ted, Mickey Mouse once received a makeover, even getting pupils in his eyes for the first time. Why? Oh, come on. It's Hollywood. We all have work done, don't we? <laughs> Help me out here, guys. Anybody? <laughs> um, for the opening of Disneyland. I agree. No, for a new cartoon. They made his eyes more expressive, so Circle gets that ah. square. All right, Janine. Angie Dickinson for the win. For the win and Angie. the dollars Angie, a recent study found that if you're having sex regularly, you're less likely to get what? Angry. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're less likely to get... I would say you're less likely to get overweight. All right. I disagree. Colds or flu. Oh. Circle gets it and the win. $4,000. We, we have a secret square $1,000 game when we come back. Right after this. Stick around. Um, it's going good except for Ted. You've got issues. I've, I've got, yes. I've disgraced the center row here. And James keeps trying to read our minds and tell us things about people. Seen I don't want to say anything. But it's you know. just weird up here. You don't even know what it's We have one thing to say. Lunch! <laughs> Promotional consideration furnished by the following. Welcome back. Good to have you with us.
Yes, we're going to get into a secret square game in a moment. First, let's uh, say hello to our contestants and give them a chance to say hello to you, our returning champion, Janine Bundy. Remind us about yourself. Hello. <laughs> I'm from Camarillo, California. I'm an electronic engineer. And in my spare time, I tutor junior high math students. All right, wonderful. Good to have you back. And challenger Dan Kutowski, tell us about yourself. Hi, I'm a clinical social worker and healthcare consultant from Ann Arbor, Michigan. And one of my hobbies is to collect celebrity photographs, autographs, and decorate my bathroom walls with them. <laughs> so you have a royal flush here, then, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Our next thousand dollar game is the secret square game, and here's what's in the secret square stash. Guess who's coming to a theater near you? You! With your AMC Entertainment Card and more! The AMC Entertainment Card is the ultimate gift for that special movie buff. Available now at AMC Theaters nationwide. Plus, We'll add a certificate to purchase your favorite movies from deepdiscountdvd.com. Guaranteed lowest total online price and free shipping every day. All worth $2,000. All right, Henry, thank you. Let's show all of you at home who the secret square is. Now you know. Janine, you won the first game. You start. Ted Danson, please. All right, Ted. Here's an interesting one. True or false, Pope John Paul II was named an honorary Harlem Globetrotter. I've played with him, and he, he, he doesn't get up and down the court as fast as he used to, but he is a very good basketball player. Um, so I, it's true. It's true. I agree. It is true. Yes, that's right. Circle gets the square. Dan? Martin Mall, please. Martin Mall. All right, Martin. Martin, uh, some plants are too plain to attract birds, mammals, or insects. How do those plants usually get pollinated? By desperate men. <laughs> <laughs> lonely, lonely crop dusters. <laughs> After a sleepless night. <laughs> Um, I believe they are um, something people learn to do in prison, actually. Um, I believe they're self-pollinating. I agree. <laughs> to everything? No. No. Wow, Dan. No, just the prison part. No. <laughs> Oh, yeah, by the wind. The wind actually does it. It's a good little kind little gesture for lonely oh. little plants. So, Circle gets that square. Janine? <laughs> Baba Booey for the AMC Entertainment Card and the win. All right, Gary, here's a little visual help here. Adam Sandler in one of his movie roles. Is it from Punch Drunk Love, Big Daddy, or The Water Boy? Uh, that's Big Daddy. I agree. It is Big Daddy. Circle gets it. And the secret square stack. All right, our next game is a $2,000 game. Dan, you could tie it up in one game, but Janine, you start. Thank you. Ted Danson, please. Ted, all right. Ted, this sitcom may not have been as popular if it had stuck with the original name of, it, of its male lead character, Larry Lopez. What sitcom is it? Everybody loves... Le no. Uh, Darman Lopez? No. Uh, <laughs> I love Lucy. I disagree. I love Lucy. His original name of Ricky Ricardo was Larry Lopez in the pilot. X gets the square. You're on the road to a tie game here. If you can pull it off, Dan, will he tie it up? We'll find out. the show enough to know there's nothing but a party. That's what it is, having a ball. Yeah, get to see me, you know, make a complete ass out of myself. They don't get to see that too often. Promotional consideration furnished by the following. Welcome back to the show. Good to have you with us. By the way, next week, our center square, Gloria Estefan, will be here on HQ. All right, 
when we last left you, it was Dan's turn. Dan? I'm going to go with David Brenner. All right, David Brenner. His book, I Think There's a Terrorist in My Soup, is due in stores this fall. David, the other book, The Science of Love, says if your love is true and not just a temporary fling, will you get fatter or thinner? Well, if you get fatter, it's going to be temporary. <laughs> well, said. well you, you know, you know you're getting fatter if you wave goodbye to a friend and when you stop waving, the bottom of your arm keeps flapping for five minutes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's, a, that's a sign, you know. Uh, I think that you'll get thinner because you get very nervous about the whole thing and you, and you just don't, you lose your appetite. I'm going to disagree. Yeah, you get thinner. When you fall in love, your body releases hormones that cause you to lose your appetite. So Circle gets that one. Janine. Martin Mull, please. All right, Martin. Martin. In the Hans Christian Andersen tale, a princess tosses and turns and wakes up black and blue. Why can't she sleep? I believe he made it up, of course. I think it had to do with a, a, a pea underneath uh, a bunch of mattresses. It was the princess and the pea. I agree. Yeah, she had a pea under her mattress. Yes. Circle. Get to them. Angie Dickinson for the block. Angie for the block. All right, Angie. What, uh, which did Brigham Young have more of, children or wives? Brigham Young. Well, like most good Mormons, he had more wives than children. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to disagree. He had more children by one. 57 kids, 56 oh wives. Hello, oh X gets the block there. Janine. Trace Adkins for the block. Trace for the block. All right. His new album, Trace Adkins' Greatest Hits, in stores June 3rd. Trace, which family's company motto is better living through chemistry? <laughs> All together, the Osbournes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I used to work for him. It's DuPont. I agree. It is DuPont. You got a block there, yeah. Dan. James Von Prague. James Von Prague is a show beyond with James Von Prague is in syndication. Check your local listings. All right, James, we all know who shot JR, but on the Simpsons cliffhanger, who shot Mr. Burns? Mr. Burns, is he dead? Hold on, let me see. Um, <laughs> actually, I think it was a misunderstanding. I think it was Marge. I disagree. It was Maggie, nope. the baby. X gets the square there. Janine. Daisy Fuentes for the block. Daisy from Style World on Women's Entertainment Cable Network. Daisy, now at over... Now at over 35 million people, the Census Bureau recently called what the fastest growing demographic in the United States? Ah, you've come to the right person with this question, Tom. Let me tell you, because mm -hmm. I happen to know it is Latinos, Hispanics, or whatever it is you're all calling us this week. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. I agree. That is correct, yes. You got a block. All right, Dan. Kevin Meany for the block. Kevin Meany starring in Shut Up and Kiss Me in theaters this fall. All right, Kevin, selling a million records merits a platinum certification. What's it called if your CD sells only 500,000? That would be copper. I disagree. It's gold. gold. X gold. gets a block there. All right. Bob ba ba for the five stars. All right, there we go, Gary. According to a ladies' home journal survey, would women rather wear a thong on a public beach or have root canal surgery? <laughs> I'll tell you one thing, either way you're going to be flossing. <laughs> I mean, most women, I got to say, they'd rather have root canal. I agree. You got a five square win, they'd rather have root canal surgery. And you got another $2,000. We are out of time, Dan. We're going to give you $500 in our thanks for being here on Square Square. Nice to meet you. Janine, you got four grand. You won another Secret Square. You're still our champion. Congratulations. Ready to take another run at that car? Yes, absolutely. All right, bonus round time coming up. Will she get the car today? We'll find out together. Welcome back. Janine is still here as our champion. You got $4,000 in the secret square stash in the front game. Janine, you know the drill here. Look at these nine keys. One of them definitely, absolutely starts what, Henry? 
It's the new Toyota MR2 Spider. Get behind the wheel of the Toyota MR2 Spider, and your sitting heart rate goes up. Get the feeling Toyota worth $24,771. All right, Janine, you know the drill. Up to now, we found out a little bit about what the stars know. Here's where we find out how much you know about them. You pick a square, I'll read a statement about that star. If you agree or disagree correctly, you've won the square. At the end of 30 seconds, for every square you've won, we take away a bad key, improving your chances of starting the car. 30 seconds on the clock for our champ. It starts ticking when you pick your first star. Kevin. Kevin starred in a movie called Plump Fiction. Disagree. Wrong, next. Trace. Once a work is a hay hauler. Agree. Right, next. Baba Booey. Baba Booey referred, is referred to in the Eminem song, Lose Yourself. Agree. Wrong, next. Daisy. Was in the soap opera, Loving. Agree. Right. Ted. Ted's married to an Academy Award winning actress. Agree. Right, James. next. James contacted Eleanor Roosevelt for Hillary Clinton. Agree. Wrong, Martin. next. Has created over 100 Hallmark greeting cards. Disagree. Right. Next. A Angie. Angie coined the phrase, one less bell to answer. Disagree. Wrong. Next. David. Wrote the bestseller, Soft Pretzels with Mustard. Disagree. Wrong. All right, ran the board. We're out of time. Let's go count some keys here. Now, this is day two as champion, so we start by taking away one of the keys. And then you got four right in 30 seconds. Let's take away four more. One of those remaining four will start the car. I'm going with this one. All right, good luck. Good Thank luck. You. I noticed today you said it didn't call to you. Yesterday the key called to you, didn't start the car. So the silent key, we'll see how the silent treatment works. you've won today and yesterday in total day two is champion you've got thirty thousand no, fifty four thousand six hundred and eighty six dollars you're back tomorrow right and you'll play for a safe full of cash if you get to the bonus round janine will be here tomorrow ted danson will be here with all the stars i'm tom bergeron hoping you'll be here too for hollywood square bye-bye i'm henry winkler oh did i have a good time saying so long promotional consideration furnished by the following I'm capable of wireless copying. Twinkle Toes here can't even do the hustle. I just don't get it. Toshiba copiers make you look good. If you want all natural taste right here, then get Briar's. I know my ice cream is natural. Briar's ice cream. It's only natural. Your pet's same exact heartworm and flea medications delivered to your home, saving you time and money. 1-800-PET-MEDS. We deliver savings and convenience.